You know, I'd say one of the more common questions we get when it comes to trolling is how do we control our speed? Do we use a kicker motor? Do we use our big motor? What if I don't own a kicker motor? Well, there's a lot of really good options out there for you if you don't have a kicker motor. Uh, and this year we weren't able to put a kicker motor on our boat yet, but I still want to be able to get down to trolling speed. So in this case, I'm using my big engine, my big Yamaha engine to, to control our speed as we're trolling. Uh, problem is, is a lot of times I just simply can't go slow enough with that big engine. So in this case, I'm going to use something that's called trolling bags or drift bags. And I have one right here. Basically all it is is a big piece of fabric that when you put it in the water, it'll actually open up and it'll slow your speed down. Now I like to run one on either side of the boat and the reason for that is because then it's pulling evenly. If you put one drift bag on one side of the boat, the boat wants to pull to that side. But if you put the same side bag on the other side of the boat, you get a nice even pull. The benefit of that is now I can control my speed. If I need to go slower, I can pull back on the throttle and slow down. If I need to go faster, I can speed up. Now today we're actually dealing with a lot of current out here. So depending on which direction I'm trolling, depends on if I'm putting the bags in. They're really easy to set, so the benefit of a drift bag is you can control your speed and you don't have to have that kicker motor.